Namaste, it's Michelle Skoletsky Boyd, intuitive medium and bestselling author. Today we're going to talk about what I'm terming attack dog. Attack dog is that personality type in the false power role of drama addiction that will actually play superior, acts like it's the top dog, but then attacks when it can't keep its position. Dominating, controlling, vindictive, provoking. It sets up its victims for failure with unrealistic expectations of perfection. Now, if you watched my last video, you learned about Let Me Fix It. Let Me Fix It learned to be that way because there was some attack dog or dogs in the family who threatened to harm, hurt, or control. And that person learned that it was better to fall in line or else. So the attack dog will threaten, will yell, and will bully in order to get their way. They will also use the silent treatment at times to show their disapproval. And by the way, this is where the Let Me Fix It learns how to use guilt. The attack dog will minimize things to keep feeling important. They will see others' shortcomings as stupidity and actually say, that's really stupid. That's really dumb. I can't believe that you actually behave that way. They will deny doing anything wrong, justify it, and then shift blame very quickly onto other people. By the way, we all have this personality and they all show up at different times. Now the attack dog has a reason to feel like it always has to be on attack. I want you just to imagine for a moment that you're the scapegoat and you get blamed for everything. You're the reason that your parents divorced. The world is cruel. Whatever it is, you are blamed. Well, the attack dog then learns how to bully. Their primary need is to feel worthy and in control. And yet they don't really want to be the attack dog. And so the moment they attack, it's not too long afterward, they'll actually move into the let me fix it role. Those of you who have an attack dog in your life can be very confused because of the ability for this person to flip so easily back and forth. In reality, the attack dog feels very vulnerable and very wounded. Anger and rage have been used as tools for so, so long. All the attack dog has to do is understand that there is a polar opposite to anger and rage. To learn more about this position and to learn how you can find healthier ways to get high on life, check out my website, soulfeltbliss.com for your complimentary pre-session consultation.